Hi there everyone, this is Liz. Welcome to a new episode. Today I'm going to do a guided meditation with you. Um, first of all, I just wanted to tell you about my latest changes regarding my recordings. And you who are loyal followers of my channel, um, I'm sure you have noticed this, that I have changed the format of the videos that, that I'm providing regarding the channelings. Uh, because I felt for, for a long time that I needed to do so, um, that the, the messages that comes from my light guides needed to be able to be read by the viewer as well to be able to take in the messages in another way <clears throat> so therefore i kind of edit myself out of the picture and i'm only reading the text and you can you can see the text and, and take in the messages in, in another way and i think that's a lot better when it comes to the channeling but of course, when it comes to this guided meditations and other things, I will still be in front of the camera and you can interact with me in, in such way. I've also um, just recently uh, put up a video with uh, affirmations and I hope you will enjoy them. If you feel they are speaking to you in any way, feel free to listen and apply them in your life. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, and as usual, a lot of things are happening around the world which can stir up a lot of energies in inside and we have to deal with all the traumas because of the outer experience um, regarding the world being in a, a kind of trauma, right? And so it, it's, it's really, if you look at it in an energetically um, perception, uh, people are healing and the earth are healing and what happens when we heal things comes up to the surface because it's it's needed to so where what whatever has been hidden within us or in our outer world comes up to the surface for a reason and that is for us to take care of it for to heal it uh, to transform, to invite uh, the new light and the new higher frequencies that we have been bombarded with for uh, quite some time now over the earth. Um, so yeah, I encourage you of course to do that and one way is to meditate because then you get in touch with what's actually happening inside of you right now, what you need to take care of, old memories, feelings, programmings, beliefs, um, negative thought patterns, whatever it might be that comes up with you, within you. It is, um, it is a year of big transformation. It was last year as well, but last year was more about a, a shock energy is what I'm being told now, uh, like a shock energy uh, to steer things up, to loosen things, um, to bring new awareness. And this year it's more about taking care of what has been coming up, to heal it, to let go of it and uh, allow yourself to step into the new um, the dawn of the new era that we are actually in at the moment. So, uh, and as, as usual, when I do guided meditations, I don't know in, in beforehand what will come up today. I've been speaking about the world at the moment, but there might be something completely different that will come through. 
uh, the meditation. So we'll see. Um, <clears throat> um, yeah, I invite you to find a place where you sit comfortably, where you can relax, turn off the noise around you, and um, let's meditate. <clears throat> So close your eyes <clears throat> Take a couple of deep breaths Allow yourself to be present here and now. There is no other place you need to be at this moment. You can just allow yourself to be present in this now. <clears throat> Breathe in calm energy and light and let this calm energy spread throughout your whole body And you don't let the breathing stop in your chest, but you can feel how this light and calm energy expand all the way down to your root chakra. All the way down to your pelvic area and down through your legs and you can feel how it spreads all over and up and in your back in your neck in your head in your arms just relax and breathe in light and calm energy And for every exhale you do, you exhale inner stress or tension or worry. You just allow yourself to let it go. That energy, it's not your natural state and you can with ease let it go. And just keep the calm and light inside. Feel it as a warm embrace for yourself. This moment is for you, where you allow yourself to just be in connection with your soul, with your inner self, your higher self, and your source.
thoughts might come and go and that's okay. Just allow them to be. Don't take such notice of what they are saying at the moment. Just let them pass as clouds on the sky. And just stay present within. And you can concentrate on a certain point, like in your heart or in your stomach area if you want to. Just feel that you are connected in your body and not necessarily so much in your mind at the moment. Step into awareness of yourself, of this moment. In every now you have this amazing opportunity to both create and Allow yourself to feel what's right for you, what choices you feel is the right one for you in every moment in this now where you're in. You have this amazing opportunity to be everything that you are. And it's about letting that energy that you have inside your soul, it's about letting that step forward. It is nothing you need to search for. It's already there. You just need to let the programmed identity step back so your soul energy can emerge with your life more so it can step forward from within and out So imagine this inner light inside of you. This bright, bright, beautiful energy that is very, very clear. Imagine and see this light, how it sparkles and shines. Spend some time to feel how this energy of your soul actually feels. How does something feel that is creation, that is life and just perfect as it is, how does that feel? Take some time to feel it and let it expand inside.
you actually are a light pillar you actually are what you have been looking for all your life in a very expression of life and experience of life your soul has been there and trying to guide you and lead you your soul who has all this gathered knowledge about everything you have been through or you are going through in this parallel parallel life experiences so the separation from the soul is this illusion that that we have been disconnected from the contact with the soul the most natural thing about you creation of life it's there inside of you already and it doesn't demand anything from you You can be whoever you want to be with love, with acceptance. It is a misconception that you need to achieve things in this human life, that you need to strive, that you need to fight for who you are. The soul only wants to experience itself in its most magnificent way in creation. Just like it is unconditionally. What if your, your source energy and your soul energy were more melted together with your present life, your personality, your identity, with your thoughts, with your feelings? with all of your human experience, what if the soul were more melted together with all of that? How would you experience life then? How much more joy can you have? How much more love can you experience? How much more abundance can you feel? How much 
how much more creation can you be can you be so again imagine and see this inner light of yours no matter how small or big it feels at the moment i want you to Imagine and feel how you expand this energy inside of you. Even if it's just a small light dot, concentrate on that dot or that energy and let it expand and feel your whole body and your whole aura your whole energy field. The light that you want in your life comes from within. Let it expand. Let it expand. Let it expand. Feel the lightness, feel the ease in doing so. Feel how happy all of your physical cells in your body is getting by you allowing this energy to expand. And if you have any pain somewhere in your body, just see this light really, really bright in this particular area. And while you're doing this exercise and expanding your light, you can also feel the connection to Mother Earth and let your roots and your energy go down to her, anchoring you with her in her caring arms, in her embracing loving energy you are safe you are safe to live your life
What if you do this every day for 10 days? For 15 days or for 20 days? Or for 30 days? How would you feel if you do this exercise and this meditation for a period of time? How much light can you bring into your own life? Where solutions come easily to you. Where bright ideas grow. Where more love in your heart are felt. How much healing can you get from doing this for a period of time? I will just leave you for a couple of minutes to experience and feel what you need to inside yourself and then I will come back again. And the last thing before we end the meditation, imagine the area around your aura, around your energy field and where that ends. And imagine how you put this bright golden light um, kind of protection around you. You know, the edge of your aura, if there is an edge, there really isn't because you're part of everything. But the energy that you in everyday life are carrying around, there are meeting a lot of other people, interacting in different certain situations and even engaging with your energy through um, online activities. And it's important to protect this bright light energy that you have. So, and you can do this in many different ways, but one way is to imagine how you put this protected um, golden light energy around your aura 
and that doesn't prevent anything from coming into you it's more protecting you from the negative energy that's not you that you don't need in your life that you don't need to carry around and be affected by so do this it's very quick procedure just imagine it and it's there energies are actually very fast moving so everything you create with your amazing mind when you use it well it will help you and when you've done that you can take a couple of deep breaths again just to feel your physical body maybe stretch a bit your hands and fingers and your feet and when you feel ready you can come back and open your eyes again Yes, so that was the meditation for today to strengthening your own inner light source and let it uh, be part of your everyday life much more in, in every way and as you noticed you kind of got a um, idea there that you can do this for um, every day for a period of time if this feels right for you otherwise don't <laughs> but if it feels right for you and um, you you maybe you are already meditate daily or something you can just infuse a part of this meditation in your everyday meditation where you focus on your inner light and let it expand throughout your whole body into your energy field and feel the lightness and the joy and, and what comes with that as it affects your, your physical body and how it can affect your, your everyday life in certain situations because, because it's very it's a high energy your soul has very high vibrating energy and if you let that come forward even more in your life it will do amazing things for you uh, and it can also help you to heal both emotionally physically and um, yeah in your mind so that was it for today i wish you the best and i hope you will have a really really good week and until i see you the next time um, be well live well live in the light energy all will be good thank you bye <laughs>